This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Follow our back here with another raunchy episode of South Park, The Sitka Truth. In the last episode, we continued exploring South Park, just trying to th find things to break and smash. But we finally ran into Tweak, who apparently needs to do chores for his parents before he can leave. So we need to do a job for him so he can come out and play. It looks like we have to go to uh, a certain... I think he said something about going to the Kenny's house to get... Or the... Uh, what's Kenny's last name again? Well, anyway, his family to, uh... No, I don't have a key for that. Anyway, so we need to go, uh, uh deliver something to... Let's see if I can show it really quick. Uh, hot coffee. Go to Kenny's house and ask Kenny's mom about the delivery for Tweaker's Brew. More coffee. Why do I feel Need like... More coffee. I have a, I have a pretty strong suspicion that we are not delivering coffee. But I could be wrong. Anyway, let's, uh... While we're doing that, let's explore some more, shall we? Whoa! Well, that was weird. The game was trying to load up there for some... I wonder how you get that. Probably some, uh... Man, that's a bit odd. Okay, anyway. I think at this point, I'm probably going to slowly stop, uh... Affecting the environment. Hey, stop that now. Oh, you can't even say anything. I'm just cosplaying, man. It's okay. Don't don't judge me, man. Yeah, cosplay is just a, another form of something else. Okay, so we need to go to the Kenny's house, which is... I think way back down over here. So technically it'd probably be faster to find a, a Timmy's uh, transport. Let's keep exploring just a little bit and see if we can maybe run across one while we're there. Oh, well there you go. Okay, well let's let's try to actually do some plot today. So since the last couple of episodes were not plot related, so let's go back to Cartman's house. Let it load up a bit and uh, let's go over there and see if we can find him. Yeah, what are we delivering to the, uh, to the Stodge? Oh, no, not Stodge. That's Butter's last name. What is Kenny's family's last name? Oh, I used to know this. I mean, I'm a fan of South Park, but I don't know, I, I don't remember every single thing about it. See, I don't think we've been in this area, right? Because before it was blocked off by rats. So let's, uh, let's do a little exploring while we're here. Uh, music stealth. You can't see me. I, I seem to see you just fine. Oh, can I not? Doesn't look like I can get over there. So. At least not right now, anyway. Because it looks like something's blocking my way, so I probably need an item or an ability to get over there. Well, we'll get to. You. We'll talk to you later, Bradley. If that is your real name. Now let's uh, peek in on someone else's house. Why not? Hey, we actually get to go inside. It's not some some gross. Oh, it's the marshes. Huh, Stan's house. Now let's see how, Stan, how his... Stan, a mess in the living room. Stan. Okay, well, this is Stan's house, but he's not here right now. I guess they kind of overlapped each other or something. Hey, Mr. Marsh. Have a fun in your underwear. Hey, guys, grab a beer and join me for Sports Center. Aren't I too young for beer? Uh, Stan's out playing that game, too. I wanted to come, but he wouldn't let me, so I'm drinking beer instead. <laughs> You go a little too far with things, Mr. Marsh. Hey, guys, Marsh. grab a beer and join me for Sports Center. Okay. Ugh. Made him drop his beer. Ugh. Okay. Is that part of your game, breaking shit? Yep. <laughs> oh, yeah, man. Tell these kids to stop. <laughs> oh, the fact that he's not stopping us, he just wants Sharon to take a... Sharon? Sharon, could you tell these kids to stop? Oh, man. I like the fact that they actually comment on the fact I'm breaking their shit. Alright. Lavish potion? We won't need that for a while, but it'll be nice to have it. Pan flutist. Oh, that's from the episode with the gerbil. It was a Craig-centered episode where he didn't want to be the chosen one, yet he somehow ended up being the chosen one. Very good episode. I, I... Okay. Eh, let's go upstairs. See if we can uh, search Stan's house. Don't mind me, Mr. Marsh. I'm going to just steal your stuff and smash more things. Thank you. That sure looks like a sarcastic trophy. <laughs> from uh, when Mar Mr. Marsh was a uh, uh, a uh, um, coach for Sarcastic Ball. I forgot what that, what that episode was. Out. Is that Tom Cruise? I'm never coming out. Come out of the uh, closet. Come out of the closet, Mr. Tom Cruise. That's the Scientology episode where Stan was considered the uh, reincarnation of L. Ron Hubbard. And I re if I remember... Ooh, more interpants. If I remember correctly, South Park... Yeah. Uh, that was the episode, unfortunately, that got them 
uh, um, Scientologists tried to like sue and uh, and get uh, South Park and or yeah, hmm. right up, right down, right. You were cordially invited and a blood orgy. Huh. Gotta remember that for later. I feel like that's important. But anyway, uh, but yeah, it also caused the rift between the South Park creators and uh, and Isaac Hayes because that was the episode they made fun of Scientologists, and so Isaac Hayes left the group because of that, which is a sad thing. He didn't even he only lived like a year or I think it was like a year or two afterwards. Like he died like uh, I forgot what he died of, but, uh, but yeah, it was a it's a funny episode, but yeah, all, too many too many people's ruffle, freckles got ruffled, which I'm fine that they did that. I mean, they make fun of everything else I like. Why not make fun of that? But apparently, apparently, too many people are hypocritical, you know. Oh, make fun of my stuff, but you can't make you can't make fun of my stuff. Ooh, got the core board game there. Yep, stands kind of I'm never coming, I'm never coming out. All right, Tom Cruise, you gotta come out sometime. We all know it's true, folks. Don't, don't don't try to deny that Tom Cruise is in the closet. He's in the closet. Why don't you come out of the closet? All right. Let's see. That was Stan's room. Who oh, the fuck ah. are you? I'm gonna kill you, turd. Uh oh. Woo. That was scary. Yep. That's Shelly. Uh, uh, Stan's sister. Stan Stan takes it takes big shits. Yes, he did. There was a whole episode based on him taking big shits. Cherokee hair tampon from I think first season when they had Cheech and Chong as a uh, uh, guest stars in it, which is weird because South Park kind of made fun of the whole guest stars thing, but uh, yeah, he they get people like Cheech and Chong. So there you go. Let's just grab another turd that we used during the during the. Um, if it splashes, it means you get a free wish. That we used against the uh, uh, um, hobos. Yeah, a lot of items you can re-get, and money can be gotten again from a uh, from ran fighting random encounters again or re-smashing stuff. Cause stuff will respawn after I leave places. Let's see what's in the. Oh, we got a shake weight. St oh, that makes sense for Stan's mom to have a shake weight and everything. Taught her the value of relationships. You're not really a a, a, a fitness machine, are you? Shake weight. Uh, major mustache. Medical marijuana card. And Sword of a Thousand Truths from the WoW episode. Man, so many references. Oh, more underpants. Two underpants in the same house? Hey, man. I almost feel bad for getting all this stuff now because you do get other partners in the game and they probably have different comments about... Uh, this is Stan's house, but he isn't here. I would, Mr. Marsh is even looking at me, too. It's kind of creepy, actually. But, uh, but yeah, because you get other partners. It's not a spoiler, but you get other partners throughout the game. So it would have been interesting to see what they said about you doing that stuff, but unfortunately, since I've already done it, well, there you go. Any stuff we can steal it? Ooh. But, uh, nothing. Okay. The re like I said, the main reason I'm doing all this now is that, okay, why not? I was about to say, because I don't, that way I can just do plot later on in the game. Like, it's ju it'll be just centered on plot, because if I get all this now, I won't have to worry about it. No, I must, I must 100% it. Mr. Uh, let's see, that's Broflovsky, Kyle's dad. Welcome to the neighborhood! Oh, what a nice fellow. Immediately became a friend. I'll take care of that snow for you, sir. Never hey, mind that. If you ever want to sue anybody, you can come to me first, okay? Oh, yeah, he's a lawyer. You ever isn't wonder he? what it'd be like to be a dolphin? Just doing flips, done that. eating fish, not a care in the world? We've already had an episode like hey, that. If you ever want to sue anybody, you can come okay. to me first, okay? He's already, already had a couple episodes based on that, too. <laughs> All right, that does it! I think Matt Stone voices him, if I remember correctly. And then Trey Parker voices uh, Mr. Marsh. Or Stan Marsh. Or not Stan Marsh. Uh, you know. Randy Marsh, that's it. Now uh, I can't go inside the Broflovsky's house yet. Or the garage. Okay, then. Fine. Yeah, are you My anyone? My frost giant is invisible. My frost giant is invisible. Oh, really? Yeah! I'm the mighty frost giant. I stand in awe of you, hero. Okay, then. Continue to admire your awesomeness. I am awesome, aren't I? All right, I think it's time. Ooh, almost dead. Ooh, furry cat. All right, now let's go to Kenny's house. On the bad side of town, which is the only other side of town. Yeah, the only poor people in town, apparently. Well, okay, for the longest time, the only poor people in town were... Kenny's family, and that's it. That's changed over the years, but yeah, they used to be the uh, 
Poor family. Eh, there's really no reason to blow up the bottles. Ugh. Oh, we even unlocked uh, Kennedy's house uh, time travel. Excellent. I just want to press it so we can unlock it. Alright. So is that locked? Okay, so we can't get in the Corvix house yet. It looks like there's a treasure chest up there if we can get to it. I'll admit I will have to go through these places once more when I get certain abilities unlocked, but that won't be for quite a while, so... There's some hobos over there. Oh, and then there's something over here. Whoa, more rats. Can't go that way. Hike at your own risk. You are responsible for your own safety from this point on. Use the street phone. Caution. Okay. Let's see if there's anything to search in. Oh, there, there are encounters. Oh, God. Oh. All right, if we get them stunned, then we can hey. get a free hit, or at least a... Don't get surprised, so that's the main reason to do bow and arrows to get the free hits so if they're stunned for a round. Alright, let's uh mug him to get some items. And we'll probably stun him in the process too. Alright. Ooh, we got a used syringe. Oh boy. <laughs> well that makes sense. Okay, anyway, let's uh Let's see if I can do the justice hammer again. Okay, so it's spin. And the press X for the hammer, Okay. There we go. Just, That's how you do we'll it. We'll see if it works. All right, let's uh, stab him while he's out for a second. Oh, does he have armor? Oh, he does have armor. Oh, okay. I don't think I have a... I can't do the hammer thing again, right? Okay. Man, this guy's got quite a bit of a... Okay. He's probably gonna do a bit of damage because he he has so much things, so I'm gonna throw... No! We don't have any change! We gave you all the change! <laughs> That'll help us against him. Okay. Do I have any more? I don't... Oh, I can do backstab. Good. That'll help out. Boom! And bleeding, too. Those, if I remember correctly, those can stack if I remember. Right, okay, let's hit him again. Yeah, if you know what you're doing, you're pretty you're pretty good till almost the end of the game. Oh, he healed too. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we get a heavy hit. Okay, this should... Oh, no, it won't finish him off. It'll be pretty close. Ah! I messed up, so never mind. Alright, he's gonna smack him. Ah! Okay. He should almost be. Yeah, he's out. Whew. That was tough. Well, I mean, not really, but uh, let's just pretend, let's just say it was for the purposes of the game. But yeah, if you know what you're doing, it doesn't get really that hard till the end of the game. Which I, I like the fact that it's not, it doesn't get super difficult till to shovel hair and all that. Excellent. Then again, I, I, I'm a f familiar with RPGs and certain types of playstyles, so if that stuff isn't that confusing to me. It's pretty easy to figure that stuff out what? if it works and all that. Oh, this isn't for me. This is for the nice people who are renting the guest house out in the back. Uh-huh, sure. Okay, I guess we talk to the nice people, quote-unquote. Can we actually go inside? I told you to go see the nice people renting the room behind the garage. All right, sorry, God. I told you to go see okay, the okay. nice people renting the room behind. Yeesh! Never deal with poor people, folks. <laughs> all right, all right, calm down. We'll we'll talk to the nice people. The nice people. Oh, they're probably they just need some coffee. You know, everyone needs coffee in the morning to get up. All the uh, oh. Huh. Yeah, yeah. We got the package for Tweet Coffee. You got the envelope. Uh, these witch Maybe. doctors must be cooking up a secret potion. Wonder if it's a healing potion. Maybe. Okay, let's see what we got here. Well, you know, I live in a state that this is kind of, well, not the biggest issue, but it is an issue, so yeah, I'm kind of familiar with this idea. Hello. Hmm, you all look like. These guys might be You look like lovely, lovely people. Here you go. Hey, that's not the usual kid that picks up the package, huh? Oh, shit. It's a kip! What? I'm not a cop. Uh, okay, fine, whatever. Alright, apparently I'm a cop. Okay. 
We got three people. Probably not too super, super difficult because we can usually fight. You gonna arrest me or what? No, apparently we're gonna fight. And I like the fact that in the the game, despite the fact that it's the kids playing, hey, they have to follow the it. rules. That all that the enemies follow the same rules as well. Uh, you gonna arrest me or what? I kind of want to stun. Well, I'll use. Well, the only bad thing is if I use mug, I don't God, usually get the chance to. Uh, so I get to mug someone to stun him, or get two backstabs over the course of. Oh wait, no, no, that's butters. I can't. Okay, so I get only get a mug and a bleed. So let me. Uh, let me stun the heaviest man. You gonna arrest right me there. or what? Okay, he's out. We got a what a bindle? What? Okay. Eh. And then if I do lightning, butters can really only do one thing, thing anyway. Well, I mean, if I use my PP restoratives, I can. So press X. Feel that ratchet okay. fury. What was that for? Ow. They're throwing shit at me. Okay, he's still. St oh, tick. really one. I go ahead and just uh backstab this dude since he's the one who hasn't been hit. And I can't throw my hammer. Eh, maybe I should have killed the guy. Oh no, I can't hit the guy in the back. Oh, but he's stunned, so there's no. You reason. gonna arrest me or what? Ah, let's see if we can finish her off. There we go. Ow. Stop hitting me, you bum. Yeah, not a meta bomb, Rock. Not a meta bomb. All right, let's set. Do you have armor? No. Okay. This cop's crazy. Ugh. Oh, right. I keep forgetting I have a fourth attack. Okay. Yeah, let's see. Arrow says, even though it doesn't matter. There you go. Yeah. All right. Apparently, we're cops and we're taking these these hobos down or meth. Uh, oh, they're yeah. meth heads. I mean, that that's what they oh, are. Good. We won. We beat the meth heads. We beat grown ups somehow. Wow. Hey, all right, they're all out. Hey, as long as we get the roof for back, I guess it doesn't really matter. So let's uh, clean up this place before we leave. But yeah, this is this is a meth place. This is a meth house, or uh, uh, you know, uh, but yeah, the state I live in, it's uh, it's not the biggest issue, but it is a concern. Really, with that information, you can probably figure out where I live by that point, or at least the general state that I reside in. I mean, you already know the fact that I live in America, but uh, yeah. Although, meth and all that is not particular to my state, but it is known for it. Let's see anything else in here before we... So we need to get that treasure. I wonder... We can't... Ah! Ah! Okay, don't touch the fire, apparently. Oh, and apparently some cash. We're full at health potion? Huh. Who knew? Apparently I don't use my... Apparently I don't use my items so much that I... Uh, no, that's not what I need. Oh, 10 is the max, isn't it? Oh, I have a health... I have a patch item, too. Okay. So we can add patches to the... Let's see. Select an empty slot. Choose a hands you want to use. Press again to put it in a slot. Okay. Okay, let's highlight. Modify. Wait, it said I had a patch. Where? I don't see anything. It says I have a patch, but yet there's nothing here. Unless it's for a different item. No? Huh. Unless you can equip it to your armors. Okay, there we go. Uh, let's see. It is a... Gain 2 PP when you deal gross damage. Unfortunately, it's a level 4, so I can't use it yet. Oh. Nice to know. All right, anyway, we got to get... Well, actually, we don't need to get that treasure chest. I want to get that treasure Oh, I don't have that ability yet. Nuts. Where are we... Oh, I can smash it. Good. I forgot that red highlights are attack, and then... Wait. Well, then, I thought... Unless there's a switch... I thought there was an item you could do or something that you could turn off that flame. Like shooting it or something, but apparently that's not it. Maybe if we go up to the next floor, maybe I'll... 
but uh, maybe we can. Oh, okay. Well, there we go. Well, that helps us get to that. Oh, there it is. Free special delivery. Special delivery! Oh, okay. Here we go. We don't have to turn off the fire. We just have to go around. Wife beater. Yeah, level one. Woo! When did it become known as wife beater? I know it became popular during the... Was it the 30s? There was a black and white film where a guy took off his shirt for the first time. Oh, right. I forgot we had to put up these man bear pig things. That's what that's for. Okay. Kenny's Bloody Club. I might as well check it out. I don't know if I'll equip it yet. Well, I don't think I can because it's level... No, it's level 2. Uh, I forgot what, what episode that's from. But, uh, let me see. What was it? Oh, yeah. Man Bear Pig, that. Go around there. But, yeah, there was a movie back in the 30s, I think it was. I forgot. Was it Clark Gable? No, it wasn't Clark Gable. But... You movie buffs would know about this, but basically it was the first time a man had taken off his, like, had shown, like, not quite his chest, but, like, a shirt underneath his chest, and he's wearing a white beard. Well, at the, it wasn't called a white beard at the time, but it became popular because he wore that shirt, because he's a famous actor and he wore it, so. Actually, I wonder if she says now, now that we've got the, oh, we can just go inside now. <laughs> All right, let's check out Kenny's house before we take, uh, Tweak's coffee back to him. Why not? We need uh, some rest time after beating up some meth addicts. Ooh, new message from Mr. Bluffusky. Oh, let's check it out. Oh, yeah, I got Francis, Mr. Bluffusky. Just landed a new celebrity client. Can't reveal her name, but let's just say she's a 300 foot tall robot dinosaur. Come on, one hit. <laughs> That's a reference to Barbara Streisand from uh, their earlier episode season. Just smashing your shit. Just ignore me. Not important. Yeah, a ton of cigarette smoke. Ooh, how fun. Anyone else here? Oh, yeah. This is Kenny's younger sister, I think? Oh, hey, you're the new kid. My sister, the princess, texted me about you. She thinks you're cute. Oh, well, it's good to know that I'm already a chick magnet. My sister, Kenny, doesn't need protecting, but watch out for her anyway. Oh, right, yeah. The, right, he's the princess, so oh, sister gotcha. Uh, okay, we'll roleplay that, I guess, if the princess likes me. Uh, nah, I don't mind people roleplaying girls and stuff like that. I play D&D, I've done that before, too. It's just a different character to me. So, play whatever you want. I might as well recycle these glass balls while we're here. Sorry to hear about the renters. Usually they're real fun and energetic. Yeah, sure they are. If you see Kenny, tell him to pick up some dinner on his way home. Not them fancy toaster strudels, though. Just regular Pop-Tarts. Ooh, toaster strudels. Going too fancy there. That's why you, ugh. That's why you go with uh, Pop-Tarts. I used to eat Pop-Tarts quite a bit when I was younger. Uh, but uh, not so much anymore. Not really my... Not really my uh, thing anymore. Nothing wrong with Pop-Tarts, just... It's not something I regularly eat. Let's go to Kenny's room. Oh, yeah, there is only Kenny's room and the kids' room, so. Yep, and Kenny was definitely into uh, the ladies. For kids that are supposed to be like eight years old, that's a little extreme, but okay. Oh, here's all the references to Kenny's stuff. Mysterion, which will make an appearance in the Fractured Butthole game whenever that comes out, which is supposed to be pretty soon, if I remember correctly, in a couple weeks. Uh, his wrestling mask. I forgot what episode that's from. Let's see, his dirty porno mags and the thing there, TV, his bike. Uh, there's, the, there's the pizza place. Oh, there's the conch shell where he broke his head to release uh, Moses. Uh, pregnant no more because his parents were trying to have a kid. He was trying to get kill the kid, basically. Memories. Okay. Ask our membership ID. Oh, yeah, oh BFFs from... Uh, uh, when Kenny when Kenny died after he got a golden PS or got a PSP. All right, let's see what's in here. Rosy cheeks, toy horse, purity ring, purity. I got a ring on my finger and I don't know what to do. Ch -ch -ch -ch. And I got rat poison in here and uh, oh yeah, I forgot. Kenny's a really big fan of NASCAR. Ooh, coffin glasses. Those are cool. An Alabama man. 
All right. After that, let's go to the backyard, and then we'll go back to Tweak and finish this quest. Yeah, that's a good length for an episode. Or it won't let me go to the backyard. Never mind. Okay then. Time to go. Time to recruit Tweak into the night into the uh, uh, back to the back to Koopa Keep, so we can uh, help fight the Drow Elves, the dirty, dirty Drow Elves. All right. Yeah, let's go to teleport there. Like I said, I'll explore. Actually, I think I've explored most of the bottom row up to here. So I'm good there, at least. So at least I'll, I know kind of where I'm going and see I've explored everything up to here. And then, well, not all of here. I'll have to come back there. Actually, that's where I need to teleport anyway, so, okay. There are other places to explore other than the town, but uh, like I said, I'm trying to get it all of the way now. But the sad thing is, later, like I said, later in the game, we will have to re-go through certain areas to uh, unlock certain things I couldn't access before. Like either having a new power or whatever. Oh, it's another hobo place. And a rat's hanging out. Let's go. Go. All right, let's clear this one out, too. What I do? How? Don't know. Oh. Never mind. I thought you were a bum or hobo I'll I had to give clear you a out. Good price. For change? Sure. I need to sell the health potions if I'm not going to use them as often. Well, I'll need them by the end of the game, but the game, I think, gives you quite quite a few. Ooh, we could even get do-rags. Let's see what those give us. Do-rag, it, it, it gain neutral color, so not to burn any bridges. You found it moist, and it's still moist on this way ahead, man. Gross. And a battered pair of kid-sized boxing gloves from the bloodstains. They were probably used on child hobo boxing ring. Have a flare. Any flare? Got eyeliner, emo wig. Strap ones. Ooh, we got some strap ones we could buy. <laughs> Gross. Uh, let's see. Gross damage on a perfect. Oh, that wouldn't be bad. Or bleeding. Gross actually seems to be pretty good in this game, even though my attacks are mainly. Because uh, there is an ability I get later on that if I do bleeding damage, I get a. Um, I don't have it yet. Actually, eh, let's buy them both. Why not? Okay, let me let me at least equip one of them. Oh yeah, we got the bloody clip. Let's see, we got four attacks at eleven by sixteen, and we penetrate armor when we hit. Uh, let's see, even the most crappily made slow and woodshop has its uses. And a weapon that stands by the redneck tradition of sticking some nails at something to make it deadly. Three attacks at slightly stronger. Oh no, according to that, it's not. Well, I mean, it's stronger initially by one attack. But because it's only three, it's initially weaker. But you get 10% more damage on a perfect hit. Uh, I'd rather keep using mine. But anyway, modify, press square. And then we can choose which, uh, just press X. And then we can choose either dead bird, we put a dead bird on it, or a toothpick. Let's put a toothpick on it because why not? Okay. Okay, let's keep going. Yeah. Didn't mean to beat you up, hobo. I just thought you were a hobo to, for me to take out. Okay, you, you store it. Can't go into the woods yet. I, can, I don't. Can I go up into the woods yet? There is a part in the game. God damn, humans are ugly. I think I'll. Uh, yeah, I'll come back here later. Well, actually, you know. What? Ooh, okay. Is it just an isolated place? Oh, it is a sensor place. Yeah, sure, why not? Never mind. I was going to do it later, but... I wanted to try to get to Tweaks by the end of the episode, but... Huh, what's that? Uh, apparently it's just a bell. Now uh, there's the veal. Episode with the veal. Okay, so we have to come back this way anyway, because there's rats in the way. So... And I think the man bear pig thing is probably over there. Yeah, let's get out of the way. Alright, what's this? Now we can shoot the cows. Okay, let's uh, take him out. And then we'll get to Tweaks. Or we'll do that. Oh, I forgot how close we are to time. We okay. We'll, we'll do this episode, and then next time we'll. Uh, we'll uh, um, uh, next episode we'll do. Uh, to finish the Tweaks storyline. Boom. Uh. Let's, uh, and then since we're here, let's go ahead and throw the hammer on him. Buy the hammer of butters! 
Boom. That was the most perfect throw I've Although ever Although that seen. does make him mad. Which I think is a slight attack power, but it means he'll be focused on uh, he'll be focused on butters instead of me, for example. Okay. Now let's backstab this guy. He might bleed out before it's his turn, or at least after he finishes his turn. That guy's got armor, but we might be able to finish him off with butters. As well. Okay, close. Looks like everyone's getting up now. But don't heal. Not cool, man. Okay. This guy's got armor. Oh, yeah, I guess we're we'll still have doing to. this, right? Yes, we are. Quiet. Okay, finish him off. Get him. It really didn't need to be perfect there anyway, so... Ah! He threw a rock at me! Not cool, man. Okay. Nice. Okay. We beat those guys. Let's grab their shit. And, uh... Strength potion. I'll need to start using that stuff because at some point I will start maxing out like what I what I have. Uh, but anyway, before we do that, let's get the. I uh, can't get in the barn yet, but I think we can get the man bear pig thing, right? Like while we're here, because it's in that uh, 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 up in that uh, top piece right there should be where we place the. Yeah, there you go. One more to go. Okay, so I'll just have to remember later on. Uh, to come back because we don't have the key to that barn yet. At least I don't think we can get it for a bit. Okay. So anyway, uh, looks like we've gotten the Tweaks oh, coffee, yeah. beaten some hobos, beaten some hobos, beaten some elves, uh, caused ca mass chaos and destruction all over the place, and now we have yet to get back to uh, Tweaks' place. In the next episode of South Park The Sick of Truth, we'll get Tweak on our side, and then go to Token's house and see if we can get the resident, well, the only, I think one of the only few black people in South Park. So, yeah. Well, that's why he's called Token, right? So, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time.